Okay, so as I explained in the class, iTunes will only let you sync one photo folder from your computer. So the way I have mine arranged is I have one folder on my whole computer for photos. And inside that photo folder, let me just put this in list view, and inside that photo folder, I have the sections divided up into personal, and then I've got my custom area, and then I've got some things with asterisks in it, and these are my JPEG uh, templates that I use on my iPad. So I have those starred so they stay together. And let's see, so you could see my one picture folder has everything in it. I've got all my scrapbooking in it, everything personal, all my JVT images that came on the CD with my books, they're all in there. And see, each, each folder starts off with JVT so that it stays here in a group. And then I've got uh, subheadings on my folders. And the reason that I do this, rather than making one JVT folder in my pictures folder and then breaking all the folders down into that, is because when you when your iTunes syncs to your iPad, it only goes down one level. So you've got your pictures and then you've got all your folders within your pictures. Any subfolders that are in these folders will not transcribe to the iPad. So that's why I name things this way. And the way it shows up on the iPad is as albums. So every one of these folders appears as an album inside my iPad once I sync, once I sync with iTunes. So let me just show you what the iTunes settings are to sync. Oh, here's my iTunes over here. Okay, so here I am in iTunes. You have to have your iPad plugged into your computer so that you can see it here in the left bar. And when you click on it, you have all these options here on the top. You're going to select Photos. And then you're going to say Sync Photos From. And there's my pictures, my one folder that iTunes will allow me to sync with. And then make sure that the radio button for all folders is checked. And as you can see, I have on my iPad over 11,000 photos. Now I do have a 64 gig iPad. And let's see, photos are taking up, for that 11,000 photos, is taking up only seven gigs of my 64 gig iPad. And some of these photos are very big. They're, they're three and four megabyte photos and, and higher. So that is really, really good numbers here to have this many photos only taking up this much space. So it's okay that only one folder will sync and it's okay to put every JPEG that you have on your computer into that one folder. When you do a sync with this many photos, be prepared to sit back for a few hours to let all those photos get onto your iPad. And sometimes even when it says it's sync, synced, I've had to go back and sync again because it doesn't get it all the first time. Okay, so I hope that that answered your question.